Hello everybody and welcome back to Hexit with me, Burgo. What is up everybody? We are out here in front of Casa del Burgo and I welcome you back to the Cyber Knight server. Alright guys, so we've got a busy episode today. We've got a lot of stuff to do, but before we get going, uh, we're going to head down to the soul room so I can show you some of the neat stuff that I've been working on. Um, and I made some soul weave armor. I just wanted to play around with that and I didn't want to just, you know, get rid of it straight away. Um, so when we're going to go on a little journey today, actually quite a large one, but when we come back, we're going to go into making, uh, the soul weave, uh, soul weave armor. So I just wanted to show that to you guys, let you know what's happening down in the rift zone. Um, but that is not the main point of our adventure today, guys. We are going to be, oh, shooting star, retrieve. Retrieve it, retrieve it. We gotta get those XPs. But, um, guys, we're gonna be heading to where it's cold, baby. We're gonna be heading to the Northlands, where only savages and a few brave adventurers have ever been. And, uh, up, up in the north, about 8,000 blocks, um, to the north of us is what what's called the Great Northern Wall, or... That's kind of a Guild Wars reference. This actually, I think the technical name is The Wall in the North. So, we're going to be heading there. And for all intents and purposes of getting more freaking loot. Because we need to finish this Necronomicon. So we can complete our goal of possibly, possibly taming and capturing an Ender Dragon. And turning it into our Spectral Minion. But guys, um, for that to be, for that venture to be successful, we need to gear up like never before. We've got our scale armor. We've got our trusty buddy Azul Grande. And what else do we have? I've got a cursed bone in case we need to summon some bone minions. We've got our Ankh in case of orbital bombardment. Um, and we are going to be looking good. We've got three huge backpacks uh, to store all the potential loots we're going to be going. I'm not. I'm not going to just, like, stop for nothing. We're going balls to the walls, guys. Because I am, like, we're going to tear through everything. It's basically a gauntlet match um, for, for supremacy right now. And I'm going to show the Nether. I'm going to show the Northlands who is freaking boss. And also, guys, we are going to open this up to our other Cyber Knights. We are going to be creating basically the tools um, to allow them to get to and from uh, the Great Northern Wall. So let's go ahead and get some wood here. And what I'm building right now is we're going to create a rift signature. And basically what that is, it's like a stationary portal gun. And basically all it takes is just ender pearls. And there is an upgradable version. There's like a stable rift signature, which is a bit better. And it doesn't take so many materials and it doesn't blow up after, you know, one, one little go at it. Um, but that's really all we need right now, guys. So let's also get a uh, dimensional warp door created. That'd be awesome. Place on a block under a rift in any dimension or place anywhere in the pocket dimension to approach the surface. Now, I think we're actually going to want two of these. So let's get, um, two more doors made here. Let's just grab this. Be easier. It's faster to drag click, so... But guys, this is going to be an amazing adventure. I'm so freaking stoked. Like, this is this is maybe the most epic adventure I've ever gone on in Hexit. Because I've never seen this northern wall thingy. Um, and I think it's going to be absolutely amazing. Let's put our enderpearl stuff over in here in our, in our weird things. This is what I like to call our weird things chest. And let's go ahead and get a wrist signature. Now, we're going to set this in the cyber tower. We're gonna head over there, drop a little rift beat um, up in the signature tower. Now this is basically what Mud set up um, in in the cyber tower to allow us to travel between the storage levels and the council chambers, and uh, this is going to allow us to fast travel basically 8,000 blocks, which is absolutely amazing. All right, and then we'll put a sign up when once we get back, so it'll be fine. Now, which which portal do we want to use? Let's use one of these. Can we do that? Okay, Rift Signature stored, right? Now, do we put the door down here? Maybe? I don't know. Should we test it out? Leads to Dimension Zero, Depth Zero. Okay, 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 cool. So I think 
that dimension door will basically be put there. And then we can put this, um, we can put this rift signature in here along with the other dimensional doors. Um, and this scroll of escape, which will basically bring us right back to Casa del Burgo in the case of an emergency. So we're going in prepared. Um, I've also got an absolute ton of carrots. I think we might pick up a bit more food uh, before we head to the nether because I like to jump around a lot and I like to fight things a lot. So that's really going to hurt our hunger in a way. Do we want to take like roasted potatoes or something? No, I don't want to wait for them to cook. Let's see if we just have some cooked meats. Um, in Casa del Burgo, and we'll also check the furnaces, because I think before I left for vacation, I put some put some bread dough in here, some flour or something. Yeah, we've got some more bread in there. That's always good to have. Just a little sustenance for the bounty. Um, hmm. We really don't have anything else. We could cook some chocobo legs. <laughs> um, now nah, we'll be we'll be okay. There there'll be like plenty of berry bushes and chests with food in it and whatnot. But just to be on the safe side, let's go grab some carrots. Because <laughs> I'm very nervous right now. I'm very nervous for this journey. Let's, hmm, okay. Yeah, let's just grab some carrots. We can replant these when we come back. I just want to get one more stack of these things. Awesome. We can make, ask someone else to replant these eventually. Okay, we've got, we've got three stacks of carrots. We should be good to go. Should be fine. Oh my gosh. All right, it's time to head up to the roof. We've got another portal ready. It's looking spiffy up there, actually. It goes it goes very well with the uh, with the with the decor of the rest of the house. Fantastic. Okay. I do believe I've got a flint and steel in here. Yes, we do. And I've got obsidian also. Let's also put that in our backpack here. Um. So when we do get like eight thousand north, I think. Are we, yeah, are we decreasing? Yes. Okay, so we're gonna be going to 8,000. Let's get our nether portal set up. <clears throat> By the dark gods. Okay, we've got Azul Grande, we've got Stormbreaker, we've got our pickaxe, we've got our sweet shovel. We got bread, we got backpacks, we got our cursed bones, we got our Ankh. I think we're good, guys. I think we are good. I am very, very, very nervous, though. But, it is time, men. This is where men are made. In we go, guys. Here we go! <clears throat> oh, mother. Oh, mother. Here we go. Let's back off. Holy lord. This is the first time I've ever been in the nether. Um, in Hexit. So, alright. Let's begin our journey. We need to head north. Unfortunately, oh my god. What on earth is all this crap? Oh, lordy. Pigman! You there, sir. What do you know of this place? Do I need to summon undead minions to quell your fury? No? Okay, cool. We're good then. Alright, let's find a way down. Let's not dilly-dally. We should be good. We should be good. Alright, what? The some oh, purple shrooms. We're getting crazy up in her tonight. All right, so apparently, oh my word, what on earth is that? It looks like it wants to challenge me though, and that is not happening today, little buddy. Oh my goodness, there, babies. Come here, you foul demons. Meet the new king of the Nether, Azur Grande. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh my, this, these materials are really creeping me out. All right, let's try and avoid mining just as much as possible because it takes freaking forever. And I have, I have no patience for that, so. Let us journey onward, my comrades. All right, oh my word, we need to take things slow here in the nether. <laughs> oh my goodness. Hello, Pikmin, how do you do? Chill out, man. Don't give me the eyes. Azul Grande is going to own your butts. Believe that, playa. All right, let's keep moving. We have no time for such pleasantries. All right. Um. Oh, that is that is a boss pig, man. We don't want to we don't want to mess with him. 
Just stay your ground, I'll pay your taxes. Right. What the? What is this? Can we, can we, like, knock this thing down? Um, hello, we should have brought an axe with us. What is this crap? What is this blue wood, dark wood? Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Alright. So yeah, guys, I've literally never been in Hexit Nether, and it is freaking terrifying right now. Ooh, kind of a tunnel-y area here. And I don't want to just freaking mine Netherrack either. Now, mind you, we have several methods of escape. We can use this scroll of escape, and that'll take us back to, uh, back to Casa del Burgo directly, directly to our bed. Um, and we also have that dimensional door, which we can really place down at any time once we get the Rift Signature set up. Let's just dig through this, baby. Let's make this thing a lot quicker. My goodness, this pickaxe is ridiculous. Ooh. Please get out of my way. Just, oh my goodness, it's like shooting machine gun. At least we'll have stuff to play. Ooh. What is this? What is this yellow stuff? Ardite ore. What does that do? I assume that's something to do with... um. What's it called? Tinker's Construct. Yeah. Alright. Let's keep moving here. Figure out what the heck we're doing. We need to get to 1,000 as our first coordinate. Ooh. Oh my. We're getting down to the depths, men. Oh my. Good lord. Is that another fortress? I do believe so. Oh my word. Oh my word. Oh my word. Come here, you beast! Oh my goodness! These guys are not happy. I killed their mom. <laughs> Come here! You beast. Alright. Is that everything? Fortunately, we have fire protection. Oh my lord, guys. Holy crap! Those spiders scared the bejesus out of me. Alright, let's keep moving. No time for this. No time for pleasantries, arachnids! Alright. My goodness, the nether is terrifying. Let's keep our butts peeled down here, men. Men, keep your butts peeled! And your eyes peeled also. Should we hop in this, like, nether fortress thing? No. I think not. Oh my goodness. Fear not, pigmen! I am friendly! I only kill your arachnid comrades because they hurt me first. Okay. We've got a gas somewhere around here. Where are you, beast? Do you wish to challenge the almighty Burgo, the fearless warrior of the Cyber Knights? No? I didn't think so. Alright. Let's see if we can... Uh, oh, we can get through here. Hello. <laughs> Alright, let's keep moving. No time for this. Oh my goodness. What is all this crap? Oh, another heat scar spider, eh? It's really a good thing we have fire protection down here. Oh my lord, they're huge. Meet Stormbreaker! Alright. Sword Tot! Eat my blade, fiends! <laughs> Oh man, it's like I'm killing these baby spiders, pregnant mother. It's quite quite disgusting, actually. Let's keep moving, though. Not a pleasant image. All right, let's go. Oh my goodness, are we are we even going the right way? I don't I don't know if we are. Um, I think I'm very lost already. That's fine. Let's just build another portal and see where we come out. <laughs> when I when I have deemed a sufficient distance traveled. And then we can make adjustments from there. I think this is Oh my word. Oh we almost fell in lava. Alright, here we go. Here's a more acceptable route. Down we go. Alright. Even if we fall in lava, we'll have a bit of time. Um, to save ourselves, just simply because we have, simply because we have fire protection. All right, and around here, this land is infested with demons and spiders. Ah! <laughs> get away! Get away! Please! Come here! 
Meet Azul Grande. Come on! Come on, you spiders! Yeah! I'm having spider legs tonight, baby. Bird goes hungry. At least we're getting lots of levels. Good grief. Cool. Oh, man. Still terrifying, though. I think we have the scale armor, otherwise we would be dead 8,000 times by now. Let's keep moving. I think this is the right way. I hope it's the right way. <laughs> Shovel deploy! Oh, dear. Pikmin! Which way to the great northern wall of the overworld? Ah, uh, you want to rumble, huh? Oh, you're gonna shoot arrows at me, eh? Is that what you want? Is that what you need? What you need is a healthy dose of Azul Grande and to stop jumping around so much. Thank you. All right. Oh, mother. Bigman! I'll see you again, my friends. Ah, jeez. This is gonna take forever if I have to dig through this crap. Uh... I don't know how I feel about this. Let's go back out. It's annoying me. It's annoying me, guys. Uh, it goes all the way through, doesn't it? Can we go over it? Is that an option? I'm not entirely sure it is, actually. Ooh, maybe it is. Just let me go over. I don't want to deal with this crap. Oh my word, flee! <laughs> oh no. Jeez. That must be a less treacherous route, and that is why I did not want to dig. Alright. Now, there's lava flowing out of that outlet, which is fine. It happens. Alright, let's see if we can go this way. Fortunately, we do not take fire damage like at all, so. Down we go! Or fall damage for that matter because I added feather falling. What's up now, son? What you got? Alright, let's keep moving. Pigmen! Escort me! Let's keep moving here. Oh my word. What is with all these. Oh! Gas are treacherous. They might not do the most damage, but they sure know how to fight fairly tactically, so. Knocking us into lava would probably be their best bet, honestly. Alright, let's get some of this ridiculous amount of nether rack we have here. Oh, where are you? Okay, let's build quickly. Quickly now, quickly! Good little bridge, like so. Oh dear, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Please build faster! Please build faster! Thank you! I'm safe for the time being. Yeah, uh, kind of. Um, okay. Let's figure out a way to get around here. Let's dig up through this. Hey, there we go. Haha. <laughs> Alright. Nice. What was that? Yay, we're through. Okay. Back on track, I think. Yeah, good enough. Alright. We venture forth, man. Pig man. Just chill, bro. I'm not I'm not gonna hurt you. I'm just gonna hurt your spidery friends when they attack me. Alright. Good grief. We might actually get there today, guys. That is amazing. Alright, let's let chunks render up a bit. Getting a bit oh frame rate lag. What? And uh, I think they're just unrendered chunkages. Hmm. Very worrisome, man. Very worrisome indeed. Oh! Not really interested in collecting any of these resources because, I mean, we can come back to the nether at any time. This trip is kind of a one, one way ordeal. Let's go and build this. And. That's beautiful. 
In the nether we go, in the nether we go. <laughs> oh, lordy, not another one. Uh, we can go around here. That's cool. Alright. Let's keep pursuing our goal, men. God, I hope we're going the right way. I'm not entirely sure we are, though. <laughs> and that is a bit of a problem. <laughs> oh, dear. But good grief, it's going to save us so much time if we did go the right way. Who cares if we didn't? It's an adventure nonetheless. And I've never been in the nether before um, in hexes, so... Worthy experience. And if it doesn't work, we can always just go back. I have another scroll of escape, it's not a problem. And you know what? We might even we might even just stay there and do some adventuring because the best adventure is the one you don't plan on having. Just remember that for future reference. Get that crap. Alright. We got here a long jump! Oh yeah. Once we get to 1000, baby, we're gonna build that next nether portal. We will hopefully be somewhat near, at least. I think we'll build it like, I don't know, 997, negative 997, I think. I think that'd be good. All right. That way we don't have too far to walk, okay. Here we go. Next little home stretch here. Let's gain some ground, baby. Let's go and run jump, just to proceed as quickly as we possibly can. Is that an upside down tree? What the heck? Why is everything so weird here? Gosh. No wonder no one ever comes here, pigmen. Everything you have is so freaking strange. Jeez. Think about the casual Minecrafter. <laughs> Alright. Let's see where this goes. Ah. Great. More of this purple crap. It really impedes progress when you have to go through all this purple crap that doesn't break very quickly. We just go through here. It's looking like we're gonna be able to, so that's good. Just to be mindful of lava. Through we go! Wee! Oh my goodness, I love this. The durability on our pickaxe is absolutely insane, so it's not really a problem at all. Keep going! Oh man, we are just cruising right now. Holy crap, Ola! This is beautiful. I'm loving this. This is wonderful. <laughs> We've got to be coming through here quick enough. Oh my lord, no, please. Oh dear. All right. Unfortunately, we're not taking any damage, so that's not really it's not really that big of a problem. But it's a little bit of a problem. It's more of an annoyance than a problem, really. But there we go. Oh my word. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We gotta be coming out to something here. Come on now. Give me something pretty to look at. No? All right, we're coming pretty close to where we wanna be. We're gonna see where we come out at. This is where we'll build our little portal. Let's just clear this out. <laughs> oh, this is so amazing. I love this pickaxe and nether rack. All right. It's time. Let's, um, good grief. There's gonna be so much crap down here to pick up, isn't there? Ardite, let's keep that tainted soil. I don't really care for another rack. All right, let's open up our pack. Let's get our obsidian for our nether portal. All right, so one, two, and three. Okay, these two, it's been a while. Like, even though I just made one, <laughs> it's so, like, it's so foreign to be making another portal because I never make these things. Okay. All right, guys. Let's hope this goes well. Let's go. Let's be ready. Sword. Azul. Let's be ready. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, my lord. We're downloading terrain. Oh, my goodness. It's going to crash the server, probably. <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't. Oh my word, I'm so nervous to see what we're in. We're gonna be in a load of trouble, aren't we? Um. Oh! What the? 
Um, we are underwater. Oh my word, there's gravel falling on us. There's sand falling on us. Um, oh dear. There's water falling on us. I think we can actually make it to the top here if we scurry a boot term. Can we maybe? Oh boy, it's gonna be a toughie, actually. Check this out. Get a torch. Thank you. Appreciate it. All right, and that'll get us to the top here. Okay. So, uh, um, what? Well, let's make a. <laughs> what on? Hello. Here, let's use this uh, nether, nether rack little platform here. Oh my. Okay. I'm gonna get this built here so we have a little standing room. Oh my goodness, what on earth? Well, I certainly don't see any northern wall, do I? Do I have any wood on me? I doubt I do. <laughs> oh, we do! <laughs> yes! We might have to go back to the nether, guys. Oh dear. Got a blue crafting table though, that's kind of neat. Yeah. Oh my. All right guys, well that is part one of our quest for the Great Northern Wall. I thank you so much for joining me guys. If you enjoyed this video and my awesome adventure through the nether, be sure to hit that like button. And if you are new to the channel and this is your first video and you want to see more, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And as always, guys, if you have any helpful comments or just want to say hi, please do so in the comments below. We'll see you next time, guys. Goo-hoo! Bye!